Ruby, thanks. Right now, the world mourning the death of basketball star Kobe Bryant. At just 41 years old, he died in a helicopter crash along with his 13-year-old daughter, Gigi. We know that seven others were um, also killed in that crash. Wake up, Charlotte Richard Vane now live this morning. Richard, the news comes as an absolute shock to everybody. Absolutely correct. People here and around the world all in shock today over the tragic news, trying to make sense of it all, a life taken far too soon. A surreal scene outside the Staples Center in Los Angeles. Kobe is so great, and I'm just waiting for someone to tell me this isn't real. The grim reality of a helicopter crash that took the life of Kobe Bryant. I heard some noise. I mean, actually, helicopter noise it was very low flying. Nine people on board, no survivors, including the NBA legend and his 13-year-old daughter, Gianna. Officials say there was fog. There was an issue of visibility and a low ceiling. An 18-time All-Star, a five-time NBA champion, twice bringing home Olympic gold. Think of one of the best to ever do it in any sport for this generation or many others. The one word Kobe will come up for sure. After retiring in 2016, he continued as a global ambassador for the sport. His passion for it shared in the Oscar-winning animated film, Dear Basketball. Passion also showcased in the last game of Bryant's career, a 60-point performance. This has been absolutely beautiful, you guys. I can't believe it's come to an end. Um, you guys will always be in my heart. And uh, Kobe Bryant will be in a lot of folks' hearts, including the folks here in Charlotte. The next half hour, we'll hear from some of the fans here locally. Also, Bryant is survived by his wife, Vanessa, and their three children. We're in Uptown, Richard Avane for Wake Up Charlotte.